was and is true every now and then. But the more important point was she did not want the press to put her mistakes on the front page. Um, it's different today because there is no censorship, but the objective is similar to harass, intimidate, and thereby inhibit the media. Um, there are two versions about how one particular individual died on the public day. Even today, I find that opinion is divided. Um, and it is true that in the course of our work, and under the pressure of deadlines or the urgency of the moment, we can and will make mistakes. That is only human. Some gave the second police version uh, almost immediately, back as it was by foot, uh, video footage. Um, others prefer to go by what the dead person's family is saying. We can and should debate the rights and wrongs of our reportage. But the question is, is any of this sufficient? All of us know what is going on. The effort is to prevent the media from doing its job. There is no other credible explanation for recording FIRs in multiple states against the same set of people with similar charges that include conspiracy, abetment of...